welcome Aquarians. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. This is the week of reading. It's for the fourth week of uh, um the fourth week of July. I want to um welcome each and every person. Um Archangel Raphael is coming out to work with you guys. So there is just some um, a lot that has been happening and I see the energy of Archangel Raphael um, wants to work um, in this week. So it's about healing, okay? There is a lot that is happening. I'm going to shuffle the cards again. There is just a whole lot that is happening, um, Aquarians. So this month of July, a whole lot is happening and transpiring. So let's go in and see what is happening and what is transpiring and we're going to be um, taking out the messages that is coming in. Now, I like changes and I choose to change up. So what is Archangel Raphael saying for you Aquarians? Okay, so let's do two cards, choose one of these cards, okay? So card one and card two. So what is Archangel saying for the first people um, that choose card one? Leave a stressful situation behind. Their Archangel Raphael, thank you for giving me um, the courage and willingness to take good care of myself, including surrounding myself with healing relationships and a positive situation. So if you choose card one, this is the energy that you're going to be receiving for card one. So all the people who choose card one, this is the energy for you. For the people who um, choose card two, you have uh, use your natural healing abilities. And it says, Dear Archangel Raphael, thank you for clearing, guiding, encouraging, and supporting my healing work. Okay, so whatever is happening and transpiring, if you're doing whatever work servicing to humanity, um, call upon Archangel Raphael and he's going to be coming in in order to support you with, with uh, whatever is going on. So this is good. Um, and what is happening and transpiring? Let me get the lights going, light skin reaction because it's getting um, so um, here. All right, so ladies and gentlemen, let's go into reading. So we see, leave a stressful situation behind you, whatever is happening and transpiring. Is it my glasses? It's filthy. I couldn't find it. <laughs> I lost my glasses, okay? Um, so um, let's see what is um, coming up for you guys. So the first energy we have is the Ace of Pentacles. So I see money is going to be coming in. A new start to your financial stability. Ah, uh, I said it. Here it is. <laughs> I said it and here it is. So then we see whatever issues you are dealing with, negative energies, uh, um, people who were using negative energies to block you. I see that this is over. Um, then I um, see... Um, yeah, new start. Some of you are going to be connecting with others in order to create financial stability. So this is good. I see some of you wanted a new start with a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn. It is going to be a yes. I see business is also going to be picking up for you guys. So that is going to be good. I see someone was trying, um, some of you, you were blocked and your financial stability was blocked. Um, um, by someone who tries to block your financial stability. So if you realize that your financial flow wasn't uh, um, flowing, it's because someone tried and someone was using negative forces to block it. So who was this person? It was a Pisces Cancer, a Scorpion person. And now what I see is that this person is now being blocked themselves, okay? So... um. A whole lot of uh, someone, whoever this person was, was intervening and uh, affecting your financial wealth. Okay, so whoever this person is and whatever that was transpiring, you're going to be finding out that someone was actually intervening and blocking 
your financial wealth so be aware of that what is happening and transpiring um so what i'm saying is that uh, you are going to be lifting this block yourself however this is coming up and this is transpiring you're going to be lifting the block yourself or um you could just your spirit guides you could just ask your spirit guides um please remove the blocks that has been happening and transpiring in my, in my world and i see the spirit guides are definitely um going to be doing that for you guys okay so um definitely um and this is the reason why they're saying just leave the situation behind whatever is happening and transpire leave the situation behind because it it doesn't serve you anymore okay it's it's not serving you anymore so leave the situation behind and this is what is transpiring so wonderful alignment of energies that is going to be coming up for you guys um, I see networking, collaborating with other people. Some of you wanted to begin a new relationship with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person, um, a young man. I see that this is um, um, going to be happening. I see that this person was blocked and this person was blocked by a Pisces, Cancer or a Scorpion person. And this is the reason why they block your relationship. So protect your uh, money whatever is transpiring protect the people who you're collaborating with protect your money if your mom is a capricorn protect this person whatever is transpiring if there is someone in your life that is a capricorn protect this person because this person in turn is going to be helping you out financially okay then we see the energy of the wheel of fortune so i see some money is um, going to be coming back some money that was taken away from you is going to be coming back i see some of you are dealing with a pisces cancer or a scorpion a, a taurus Virgo, or a capricorn person but it's more mostly coming up as a capricorn person and this could be your mom protect this person some of you you're dealing with your mom and your mom is a sagittarius i see she's going to need some financial help I see help is going to be coming in and I see that you're going to be collaborating um, with a Capricorn and a Taurus. So some of you could um, be collaborating with a Capricorn and a Taurus. So however way that is going, that is going to be bringing some sort of a stability. Whatever that was transpiring um, with your financial stability and there were some issues, I see you're going to be overcoming these hardship. Some of you were dealing with a Taurus person, whoever this person is. You were dealing with a Taurus person that has created some issues in your world. Then I see um, money is going to be returning to some of you or some of you might have to be paying. But I see that this Taurus person have to return a whole lot of money to some of you. Some of you are dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion, whoever this man is, we're going to be finding out who this man is. And they're going to be finding out that this man needs to pay back some of you a whole lot of money. Whatever this man has done and whatever the estrons are. The truth came out about a young Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion. Um, they are finding out the truth of who this person is. Um, if you are feeling negative forces or you're not feeling good, it is a Pisces, Cancer, a Scorpion who is doing this. I see heartbreaks is coming up for some of you that is in a relationship with a um, Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion. I see heartbreaks. Heartbreaks is coming up for you. Um, heartbreaks for people who are in a relationship with a Libran. I see a new start is going to be coming in. I see the offer of a new start. So if you're applying for a job or you're looking for a job or um, a new start with a new relationship, yes, it's going to be offered to you. It's going to be a yes. Okay, um, definitely. Then I see you're going to be finding out who your enemies is. And some of you are going to be finding out that a cancer or um, it doesn't um, some of you is a cancer, but some of you, you're going to start protecting yourself from your enemies. OK, um, I see definitely that some of you, your if your mom um, is a Pisces, if your mom is a Sagittarius, um, I see you have to financially help your mom out and this is going to be good so if your mom is a Sagittarian I see you financially have to help your mom out 
I see you're going to be protecting your mom from some issues. Some of you, your mom could be in a relationship with a Libran, and I see some heartbreaks. Some of you are realizing that uh, um, a cancer has created a whole lot of financial blocks in your world, and you're going to be releasing yourself from this. So, so the energy with money and especially um, some of you are going to be really connecting with a Taurus um, where networking with a Taurus could help out some of you. Some of you want a new start with a Taurus and it, um, the, it is a yes. They're going to be returning to you. An offer is going to be coming to you of a lot of money. It's as if, if um, a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn and borrow some money, I see they're going to be returning the money to you. So this is going to be good. Heartbreak is coming up for a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion. I see a judgment call is coming up on this person. Um, I'm not sure who this person is, but I see some news is coming to this person. Some judgment call is coming up on this person. So let's see what is happening and what is transpiring. So some of you that have kids, um, this is going to be good. Some of you are going to be finding yourself pregnant. Whoever have kids, um, some of you are going to find yourself pregnant. Um, some of you are going to be finding out that uh, um, you are pregnant. And I see um, that um, if you're pregnant for a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn, they're going to say, let's get back uh, um, in a relationship. Obviously, I see um, a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn is going to be offering you to work with you. Okay, so this is wonderful so whatever is transpiring i see a taurus virgo a capricorn is going to be offering you um to come and work with them okay so i see a new start to your financial stability i see a whole lot of you are protecting yourself protecting your kids and protecting your financial stability the ace of pentacles is here and it's just going to be wonderful i see some good news is coming in so if some of you had applied for a job if some of you applied for any financial help or if some of you um, had lent out some money, the money is going to be returned. So um, that is really, really positive news. Uh, the money is definitely going to be returned. So I see some of you um, are going to be finding out some news. I see a Taurus, Virgo, a Capricorn, young person between the age of 18 and 45 is going to um, um, let you be aware that um, someone has been creating some deceptiveness and horrible situation around you. I see fortune. Fortune is here for you. Some of you are going to be receiving some message that they found out that a Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion has taken a lot of money in your name or this person could have um, hijacked your identity and take your taxes and they're going to be finding it out and they're going to be returning it. So this is what I was saying that... Uh, this, um, whoever the Spices Cancer Scorpion is, is a young lady between the age of 18 and 45. They found out some deceptiveness that this person has done and tried to steal from you. And I see that they're going to be um, helping to return this money to you because they realize that this person is really um, deceiving. So um, this is really coming up for you guys. And I see a, a lot of hope. I see as if you guys are open, open for um, a better tomorrow, open for a situation to resolve with a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion. However, this person is coming up in your life. Some of you are dealing with your father that, that is a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion. And I see whoever um, this man is, or it could be your partner. I see some heartbreaks. Um, that is going to be coming up for some of you because of some deceptiveness that this person has done. So I see a whole lot of you are protecting your financial stability. And if you're in, um, if you're working together with other people, you're protecting your materialistic wealth. Okay. There is definitely some of you that is going to find out that you're pregnant. There is no question. It is coming up. So I see some deceptive play. The wheel of fortune is going to be letting you see who your enemies have been and um, it is going to be removing you out of the way I see some good news is coming in because whoever the Taurus is I see the story some of you either is in a relationship with the Taurus or the Taurus you work together with the Taurus and I see you and the Taurus is going to be creating some form of stability so definitely a new start. Some of you wanted a financial help. Some of you, your parents or maybe a family member that is a Sagittarius wanted some 
um, financial help I see this is going to be coming up new start is going to be coming in some of you are protecting yourself from your enemies I see you're going to be receiving a letter that a new offer is coming up for some of you um some of you are dealing really with someone that was using negative forces in order to block you and your financial stability and I see someone is going to be returning this wealth to you because they realize that they were blocking your financial flow okay as someone was being involved who was blocking your financial flow so um what is happening and transpiring is that i see um the energy here of money is going to be returned to some of you aquarians so it could be a pisces a cancer man I have to pay some of you aquarians a whole lot of money i see some of you a cancer man is going to be offering you a new start um, as some of you are going to be receiving a news a message from a cancer however that is um, coming up but this man is as if this man wants a new start whoever this man is want to reconnect and want to have a new start whatever is transpiring and you had a sister or a friend that was a, um, a Pisces cancer or a scorpion and whatever that was transpiring with this person I see you're going to be overcoming it and you're going to be realizing that this person has been the person that has been blocking you for quite some time so I love you guys please like and share these readings let me know how it is so you're going to be finding out about some deceptive play and you are just going to be letting it go walking away and said you know something um, I'm better off without you okay so I see a new start is coming up some good news is coming in and I see fortune is on your side namaste